bringing you the raw reality of artists out of the top of the Palmetto State. This is Upstate Uncut. <laughs> Presented by Envision and Jetlag TV. We bring to you Pressure, 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 Pressure. They never show respect, they need to cut it. Keep talking about the check, they need to cut it. Pressure ENT is an independent music label based out of Spartanburg, South Carolina. The label consists of the duo Stack Boys, the young R&B group Dammy, along with the lyricist Luck. Pressure ENT begins with Jordan Collick and Tay Robinson, better known as J-Boy and King Elvis, to form Stack Boys 864. Jordan and Tay linked up together in junior high school and decided to join the rap group Stick Up Kids. You know, yeah, we broke off from them after a while, you know, we felt we had a better connection, you know what I mean? We broke off and we turned and called ourselves the Stack Boys going to the, um, Going to the studio. Going to the studio. To make our first song together. Call Stacks. Stacks in the building. Stacks in the building. Hey boy, hey, hey. Stacks in the building. Hey boy, I'm a stack boy. Don't know how to act, boy. Beat stomping hard like a frat boy. <laughs> Nigga trying to take my seat in the game, but I won't give it up. I'm Rosa Parks. Originally born in Florence, South Carolina, the wordplay whiz Luck brought a classic hip hop vibe to Spartanburg. Prior to joining Pressure, he rapped with the group called PG Boys and a friend by the name of Matt Young before going solo. As a solo artist, he released his mixtape Still Trying, The Dreamer, and Rider Music. Then shortly after he joined the label Pressure ENT, he delivered underrated and live under constant knowledge, or luck for sure. Dammy 864 merged together while attending Spartanburg High School. Zach, also known as Zabo Gotti, and Deontay, also known as Steves, were the first to take their shot at music with What You Need and No Flex Zone Remix. Later, Ashley, or as you may know him, Pizzo, got with the two to officially create Dammy 864. Inspired by his younger brother Zabo, Jordan got Stack Boys back into the scene heavy. My young brothers, they really ran off with you and was just calling themselves Dammy. And then we hey, we, we in school in Orangeburg, and I'm like, damn, you can't even Dammy. What's the shit we came up with? They really Dammy. running with this shit. Dammy 864 quickly became a fan favorite with smashes like Shower, Scream, and Cigar in the Rubber. Since then, Dammy 864 has released two projects and opened up for T.I. Dammy, what is Dammy? What is Dammy, bruh? I'm a T.I. I ain't gonna sugarcoat none. Don't sugarcoat. Rich kids had a song on uh, 100 bands. It was some other people on it. It was one dude. He was like Smash Game Danny. That was his name. But we switched it up. I don't know how we started saying Smash Game Danny. Every time we listen to that song, it stood out. It fell over into our lifestyle, what we do, you know what I'm saying? We don't get no detail. It's kind of like just the overall effect. You know how they pop up in the house? Yeah. <laughs> you know how they pop up? Through a mutual friend, Luck was able to run into Jordan of Stack Boys 864. Luck allowed Jordan to hear his latest tape, which led to the two being together at the in-house studio. Through that, we just became closer and closer because we had the same kind of vision as far as music go. And I, I do this um, recording engineer, sound engineer. So he was just like, look, man, we want to work with you. And it just came about that. What started as Luck just wanting extra change in his pockets became a long lasting relationship between the two. During this time, Dammy 864 was on their run with the hottest music in the city. To take the music to another level, Stat Boys 864 featured Zabo on the city hit, Hell or Heaven. You a bitch and I can tell it. Don't speak a rhyme, cause he gon' tell it. Hell or Heaven quickly gained traction in the upstate, becoming the hottest song out during the time. Due to their growing friendship, Jordan invited Luck to the video shoot for Hell or Heaven. This proved to be a turning point to the creation of Pressure ENT. What really I think just took it off as far as timing and meeting up with the right people at the right time with my little brother and Dammy 864 meeting up with Luck. Yeah. People already knew who we were and they knew Zach them too. Zach got their own wave and everything. But I think what really took it to the next level was like, oh, like really Pressure ENT and everything like that was the song Dammy Lady.
Once Pressure Entertainment was formed, all the artists got together to deliver probably the hottest hit to ever come through Spartanburg. Dammy Lady. Dammy Lady is Pressure ENT's rendition of Gucci Mane's Candy Lady. Man, we ain't know it's gonna take off. Like, I think it's gonna do that. Smash, smash. Pressure came with Dammy Lady and all that. We became a family. We were boys. After taking off with Dammy Lady, Pressure NT went on a crazy run in 2015. Pressure NT was a part of 35 shows, a spring fling show, and one of the hottest bashes of the city. Collectively, Pressure ENT has released three collaborative projects while also releasing some of the highest viewed music in the city. The members of Pressure ENT are pioneers to the music scene in the upstate and have also stamped themselves as legends in Spartanburg, South Carolina. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Inspiration is from the city too, because don't nobody, ain't nobody from Spartanburg really done made it out and the city and the state need somebody to make it out and some role models to show others that hey man just like just people know us from Swan High know us from just being regular people you know what I mean y'all can make it just like we we can you know what I mean and we humble and we stay humble we real thankful for all the stuff that's coming our way at the same time we know people want somebody to look up to because ain't too many good role models out here so you know what I mean we trying to set that standard and be the ones from the bird from the city to really put on man I don't want to die for them to miss me yes I see the things that they wishing on me Hope I got some brothers that outlive me They gon' tell the story was different with me God's plan, God's plan I hold back, sometimes I won't, yeah. I feel good, sometimes I don't, like.